Oh, eine Mojang-Lage. Was that... Was that a Sega reference? Sega! Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we are back on Minecraft. Now, we are on Minecraft Snapshot 20W14 Infinite. Basically, it's the um, April Fool's uh, Mojang thing they're doing, like a snapshot, which basically adds infinite dimensions, which I think is sick. I haven't done any more research than that. I've just watched the trailer. So I have I've noticed that all my worlds are gone, but I went back on my pre on like the normal Minecraft and all my worlds are still there. It seems to be just this snapshot. So I guess we're just creating a world. There we go. Right. If this doesn't take like this whole discovering all the dimension stuff doesn't take up all the video, I've got um on my phone like the list of stuff that came out in the late in the snapshot before this. Because it added like a completely new mob, like what's it called? It's called a um a strider. It's got like warped fungus on a stick, low lo lodestone, lodestone. It's like I don't know. It, I I just thought it'd be a good good snapshot to do a video on because it added some new stuff. And to be honest, I don't really um I don't really go on snapshots that much anyway. I went on one of the nether ones like a couple days ago. And I played for like five minutes and I got bored. I don't know why. I just don't really like doing them. Maybe it's because instead of discovering for myself like I am this episode, I just look on YouTube. But um, if it gets a bit laggy in this video, I'm very sorry. I don't have my Optifine on. Yeah, let's discover some worlds. And I can't zoom. Mm. Okay, so I did look on a video on what you had to get to like... um. Whoa. Oh, I need obsidian. It's all messed up. It's all messed up. This is cool. Oh, a target block. I never actually, like, looked at those, like, what they do. Well, I know what they do, but... Warped door. Crimson door. Are these part of this, or, like, the, the nether update? See, this just shows I don't look at snapshots. I don't know why, I just find them boring. This is cool. Okay, anyway, all right, I did actually look up on a video what you need to do to get to different dimensions. And you basically just need an, a regular nether portal, and um, you need one of these, what's it called? It is a block of infinite books. So apparently there's different colours. I don't know how many colours there are, maybe it's just those. Uh, yeah, so that gives us a nice selection, but let me just build this nether portal quick. And kablooey! Okay, so basically what you do is you just right click on these and it should give you some nice books. Cool. Alright, so we've got a nice range of different dimensions to go to. Hopefully this doesn't get too laggy, but you just um, press Q to throw it at the nether portal and it should change to a completely different colour. Oh my gosh. Wait. What? What? The frickin's... <laughs> what is this? Oh my god, it's a, um, it's a ship. It's a, it's an, it's an end city. Yeah, that's the word. <laughs> this is insane. This is actually insane. What is this? What is this? Is this gold? Wait. That's gold, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Alright, let's have, let's have a look around. Let's proper have a look around. So this is a green village, and the villagers are wither skeletons? Wait. Oh, I thought the mobs changed. I thought this had a different colour then. Alright, villagers don't change, I don't think. Wait, let's have a look. Are you darker? Are you pinker? I think you're dark pink now. Ah. Hello, buddy. <laughs> Door's different as well. This is so... This is nuts. This is just the first dimension. This is nuts. Let's have a fly around. Let's have a proper fly around. I can always make a new nether portal. I don't need to keep track of where it is. 
<laughs> There's just... Is there actually elytras in here? Whoa, that's getting laggy. I need... To... That's bones as well. What is that? That's just coal. Douche. I need to see if there's elytras in here. There probably is. There's no point in me actually checking, is there? Yeah, it's just normal stuff. With... Ooh. Are there... Do any of these stack? Are any of these the same? No, is this a completely new one? Nice! So you can find different dimensions in different dimensions. Alright, so this one... Wait, what is this? Oh, that's water. Whoa. The water's, like, brown. Maybe it's just a dirt underneath or something. But, yeah, this world is basically just a green village and loads of ships. Alright, um, let's see what the next one has in st I'm green. I'm, I'm pink, sorry. I'm pink. <laughs> Alright, let's build a, um, a another nether portal. Okay, so what I'm going to do is actually do them in order or where they are in my inventory. So, because I just got this one and it's closest to the end of my inventory, I'm going to do this one. And this is a pink one. Maybe this is the same one. Maybe it just gave me the same one. Um, because I already used it so it wouldn't have stacked any of them. Hopefully it doesn't lead to the same place. If it does, carry on. Woohoo! <laughs> this has got a load of end things. I can break them. Oh crap, lag, 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 lag. I didn't realise you could break these. That is insane. If I had my zoom, it could cover up the whole screen. Alright, so this has a lot of slabs and stairs. And a lot of coral. I think this is. Is it coral? In, like, potted plants. Why is it raining? Why is it raining? Alright, there's bees. But why is it raining this weird colour? I'm confused. Why it's raining this colour. How high does this go? There's just infinite islands. It's getting really laggy. If it gets really laggy for you, just remember I'm going through the same trauma. Oh my god. I'm gonna fall down. What frames are we at? We're at we are at we are literally at one frame two frames a second. One frame a second. Okay, I don't like this demon John. Seems quite boring anyway, it's just loads of um stone slabs and wooden stairs. But anyway. Oh, a piglin. I've never seen you before, like, actual, like, in-game. This is really, this is really annoying. Okay, I'm gonna go to the next dimension. Oh my god, I finally constructed the nether portal. Uh... Go. Move. Oh my god, that world was so laggy. This just looks like the end. <laughs> with a wood on the bottom. Alright, and stone and wood. <laughs> they do not go together and look good. I just realised that rhymed. Bruh. And stone and wood. They do not look good. <laughs> There's some patches of pink here, which look really weird. I don't know if that's just the end stone or where it's placed. Okay. It seems like it's just what it seems like. Just a bunch of um, end stone with wood on the bottom. So, next one. Ooh, light blue. <laughs> Here we go. Always got the new um shroom. What's it called? Shroom light, I think. What have we got here? That's a lot of shroom light. Do you guys hear that? That's a new sound effect. Okay, so we got some purple water. We got some elder guardians. Hey, buddy. And some coral. And oh my god, these are nether fortresses. Jeez, a terrible fortress. I guess I have never been to another fortress before. I'm kind of amazed by what what Minecraft can come up with in terms of like these weird dimensions. Like Mojang said in the trailer for this, that there is one billion. There is one billion of these to explore. This is insane. We're going to get through a, a few handful, and you get advancement if you go through all of them. But that's only for today. Okay, I think we are... I think we are doing the next one. So I'm just going to put the nether portal right here. Because I'm not entirely sure where else to put it. Hopefully we don't get another laggy one like the one we just got. And yeet, what colour? Wait, this seems like... This might be... This might be the same one. So... What do we have here? 
lava. Alright, so we have another one of these. Um, we have some new blocks. This is... Um, I'm not entirely sure what this, what this block is. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, so it's, it's, and it's another one with loads of these end gateways. Oh my god. So laggy. And a bunch of clay. Okay, I can't stand this one. I'm just going to um, get another nether portal. This. Oh my god. Ooh. To be honest, I think it's the ones which have loads of nether portals. I don't know what they're actually called. I just call them nether portals. I know they're not called nether portals. Yeah, I think it, it seems to be the ones with those nether thing. Um, those. What? Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I've been calling them nether portals this whole time. They're end things. They're end gateway portals things. Um, yeah, I think those are the cause of the lag because the ones I've been in which have those in are the ones with the most lag. So, I'm just going to hurry up and make a portal. Sounds like a plan. Okay, after about 20 minutes of doing this, We finally have another portal to throw our book in. Please. Oh, whoa! It's got multi colors. Just go, just go. Oh, my screen is green. Um, don't know what's happening here. My screen's green. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This seems normal. But I know it's not because the sky's green. Okay, okay, okay. This seems like a less laggy one. This seems like a normal one. Yeah, this looks close to the overworld. Very, very much. Whoa! <laughs> it's got blocks of um blocks of uh, podzol on top of each other. Looks stripy. But yeah, everyone's unique. It's one in a billion. Okay. Um, it's not really much to do, really. It kind of just looks like the overworld, so I'm going to skim through all the boring ones because I don't want to get to the new nether update. I'm not the end of nether update, like the um, the new creature and stuff like that. So let's throw this in. This, I think, is a different one. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't think we had that color before. Is this um, stripped acacia log? It's stripped acacia log. It's stripped acacia log. We got enderman on end. So. Seems legit. But doesn't seem much else. Some of these are quite boring, actually. Obviously, obviously, most of them are going to be because it's a billion, so you're gonna have loads. But this is um, this is weird. The way that lighting works in these is so cool. Looks like those glasses you have, like the old school 3D th glasses. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> mean noob. Right, I just, I just, I just realised that um, I, I built the Nether portal. <laughs> one too high. It was, it's one too low. It's two by two. I, I was wondering why it wasn't lighting. There we go. <laughs> this is the last one. Second to last one. No. Ooh, another multicolored one. Let's see what we get. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, I'm green. I'm green. I'm green. Why is there a bunch of withers? <laughs> I was underwater. Why is there a bunch of withers? I don't know if I was underwater or not. A bunch of withers. <laughs> how many is going to spawn? And how are they spawning? What? Where are they? My brightness is turned up, I can't even see. It's quite dark, actually. There's a wither here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, why angry are you? Are you kidding me? What if I... What if I... Wait. Oh, yeah, and me. Crap. Ah! I shouldn't have done that. Okay. That was not good. Hey, right, I was just going to try and kill the withers, but all right, we had one more to go, so I'm going to get one more which I haven't done before, and see how it goes. 
Right, nice. I just went through a load of them trying to get a different colour. And I just got I just got a nice red one. Sweet, let's see what this one has to offer. Here we go, the last one. Ooh. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> This looks so weird. What even is this? This, this doesn't... I don't remember this. What? I can't even, like, take it. It's literally a block which you can't use. What is that? Is that dirt? Oh my god, it's wood. This is weird. This... That's... that's I keep saying weird. I keep saying this is really weird, but it is really weird. <laughs> Oh, there's a new thing over here. What is this? Yellow. Oh, we got a new area. What? Where is he? Where is he? No! You can go on top of it and there's a whole nother area. And an ender dragon. There's multiple ender dragons and end city, um, ships. I kind of want to look at one more. I, I, I gotta do it. I gotta get one more up and go above it. Go, like, above the world. To see if it will, um, <laughs> to see if we'll have, like, a completely new one. Here we go. We have a new one here. I'm surprised I'm not lagging that much. Like, two end, like, multiple ender dragons in the same world. And a new world under it. That's probably why I'm lagging so much. There's world, there's dimensions on top of dimensions. Okay, don't know if I had this color before. I think I had like a, a lighter color of this. I'm really excited. Whoa, that's blue. It changed. It changed. All right, I'm just gonna go straight up. I'm just gonna go straight up. See if there's any um, like new place. Or maybe it's, no, I don't think it's one of those ones where it hasn't. Where it has like a top. Yeah, this is a laggy one. Stop lagging, I wanna place my nether portal. Yes, one block of nether portal. Okay, so now it's time for part two of this video. Okay, so this half of the episode is sort of gonna be like a mod review. Like where they have like all the things and they craft it themselves and they show it off and all that. Why are there so many endermen? Sorry, I didn't spawn these in, but why are there so many endermen? Sorry, getting off track. Basically, um, I'm just going to show off all the new stuff which was in the, um, which has been added to the Nether update. So let's get started. I have them all on my phone, so if you see me looking down a lot, then um, that's what I'm doing. But there has been one new block added, and that it. Don't you be doing that? All right, a new block. The only new block that's been added is called Lodstone, or Lodestone. I'm going to call it Lodestone. But you craft it like that if you want to know how to do it in the latest snapshot. But here it looks like, um, it does look a bit like chiseled, just a little bit different. This looks cool, it could be nice for like Roman sort of buildings, like Greek. That looks quite nice actually. What you can do is with this is basically, you put it down and get a compass and like click on it, um, like right click on it, it turns into a lodestone compass and it leads you to that specific lodestone. So if you put a lodestone say over here, lodestone say over here, it will lead you not to this one, to the one you assigned it to, which I think is really cool. And if you break it, it just goes all crazy. <laughs> okay, now for items. This item is called Warp Fungus on a Stick. You can craft it like that. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can do it anywhere. Oh no, I just got lucky. Warp Fungus on a Stick, that is how you craft it. And you can use it to lead, to like um, ride the next mob. So the next mob is called a Strider, which can be spawned, okay. So this is what a strider looks like, and if you have them on the th in the lava, they can actually walk. So what you can do is actually they have a they basically I'm I'm going to tell you a little bit of information about them. a new passive mob that spawns in the Nether on lava oceans, like this one here. Um, they can be saddled or controlled with a warped fungus on a stick. They are damaged by rain and water. Can be bred with warp fungi. Can spawn with mod. Shush! I'm trying to read. They can be sp they can be spawned with zombified piglins or baby striders riding them. If they spawn with a zombified piglin, they will also have a saddle equipped. Right. So this is what they look like. 
they are attracted to me because I'm holding a um, warped fungus on a stick, which is neat because you can put a saddle on it and sit on it and then hold this, you can go. This is nice because people have been asking for frost walker for the nether, like lava, and we haven't been getting it. So this is a really nice way of exploring the nether. It makes it super easy. And when it when um, the nether update comes, um, I would have made my survival world by then, and I'm going to explore in the nether so goddamn much. This is really cool, like how you can ride these on the ne in the um, oceans. And unlike a pig, these are actually really fast. Like you can hold shift, and it's sort of like a sprint. Like you can see it goes into sprint mode. It's actually like running. And another thing is that, um, like you just heard, they also spawn, they can also spawn with baby ones on their backs or zombified piglins. So I'm going to try and get those. Oh yes! So I got one on top of his head. I got a baby one on top of his head. That is one out of two. And that is two out of two. That's the zombie pig piglin on top of him. But yeah, these are the um, strider mob. Yes, mate. <laughs> the noise they make is like a pig. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, they're attacking each other. Oh god, he's getting hurt. He's getting hurt. No, let him move. <laughs> okay, um, this is too loud. I'm gonna get away from you. I'm gonna get away from you. I just found something really weird. I was trying to break some blocks here to um, make create a nice base, but look what happens on the side of blocks. Like on the side. So Wait. Hold on, guys. I just had a, m I just had a really cool idea, and if this works, this will be absolutely amazing. Okay, I've got an idea. Let's see if this works. Yes, yes, this actually works. Watch, watch. If you're in the lava and there's a two by and, the and there's like a two high wall, you can like go super fast along it. That is something that could be used. That can be used. Okay, okay. This is really nice. So. You can basically make, you know those sort of ice um, traveling things where you bump your head up and down and you can go really fast. Maybe you could put two like walls next to each other in a one block space and put like, and you could ride one of those in the middle of it. Maybe I'll go super quick. Hold on guys, I need to construct something. Right, I have constructed this here. I'm going to go in the middle and see if it makes me go really quickly. If it does, this would be a really nice way to travel. Right. Okay. Okay. So it only works if you're like pushing into one of the walls. That's 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 good to know. So if I go in here and push to this side. I'm going to try this again. You have to get a really good angle. There is something there. There is definitely something there. Okay. So that's going to be the end of this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you liked it, make sure to um, hit the like button. Because if you liked it, you should hit like. But anyway, subscribe and turn on notifications if you never want to miss another video from me. And if you'd like to see more of this. And also, 200 subscribers. Foot reveal. Subscribe if you haven't already. Please. But anyway, this has been really fun. The first half of this video was really nice. I really like the uh, April Fools and like the infinite, infinite dimensions. And I really like the second half with the nice nether. I can't wait for the nether update to come now with these new mobs. It's a really nice way to travel in the nether. Make nether exploring really easy and fun. More fun. But anyway, that is going to be the end of this video. Good goodbye. And I hope you don't die. Jeez, his face. Guys are so derpy. <laughs>